Aspiring animation creator alleges corporate bias against diverse creators. Alleges that a certain company bug and accepted pitches of diversity teams at the backlash against titles that only advertise diversity without releasing trader. Aspiring animation creator Sarah Ayesa wrote the Twitter thread on Saturday alleging that a certain huge company that produces animated shows as bias against original pitches for shows with diversity elements such as people of color, lead character, and LGBTQ. Plus, the company alleges played the tea, spilled the tea to A Aisa regarding the show the found that they were diverse because it featured an all girl cast with variety body types and LGBTQ plus representation. Instead of releasing a trailer with animation footage, the company produced a video highlighting the creators as they talk about the diversity present and the show as a selling point. According to Aisa, the company received backlash for this move. It's not less concerning to find shows that were features diversity teams. So after the creators who used diversity as a selling point instead of promoting the story because then the person wants to pitch a show with an authentic diverse cast, not for the purpose of promoting diversity, gets put in the back burner PC executives would think a fun like the other sh show they funded, tweeted Elisa. Outro and Elisa has declined to specify the name of the company, who also promotes a YouTube video by Clownfish TV, which speculates that the company in question may be Crunchyroll. Clownfish TV discussed the similarities between the scenario Aisa, who is referred to in the video by her Twitter name, Sarah Mombami, described in the announcement feature High Guardian Spies in August 2018, embedded below. Aisa commented on Clownfish TV's video on Twitter saying, There's a super ninja they as well as got their facts right. Ryan Rodriguez's High Guardian Spies was initially announced as the first Crunchyroll Originals anime project and was slated to premiere in 2019. Rodriguez announced on November 2019 that the show had finished production and has so far not been announced for the specific premiere date. Crunchyroll Studios' Margaret Dean is the president of the Women Animation Nonprofit Organization. When High Guardian Spies was first announced, she commented on High, High Guardian Spies will have a 100% female writer's room. In which sense, he has shows about young girls and our crew is 50% female. We're identically an LGBTQ plus diverse. Plus diverse. He uses tweets called the Women Animation Project a scam, alleging that the white social writers in the LGBTQ progressive shows hire only other white women. On Monday, Rodriguez tweeted, seemingly as opening in reference to Aisa's criticisms, just wanted to put this out there for no reason at all. I am the transgender woman and the first generation Cuban American. Onyx Equinox Storyboard, artist Samir Barrett, and series creator Sophia Alexander, also personally expressed general frustration about the marketing and properties with diversity teams rather than the story itself. It's absolutely shitty when studios this kid interestingly use diversity as a marketing tool of our selling a good story. Properly but assume that the choice of a creator is obviously no evidence to support that is foolish. Creators have the power to say and whatever the show is presented to the world the world. Heck we don't even have a say on what the logo looks like. Many people assume the wildest things I even want to do is tell a story we hope people contact connect with. Onyx Quinox is another Crunchyroll original show, which is announced to premiere this summer. An anime work, a young Aztec boy is saved dead by the gods and chooses to act as a humanity's champion, forcing to discard his apathy toward his fellow men and improve humanity's potential to fight the span across fantastical yet authentic Mesoamerican cultures.